zone is sectioned off, sir. Please step back. Agent Norman Jaden, FBI. You got a badge or something, Mr. Jaden? Yeah. Yeah, of course. Check. You can pass. I'm looking for Lieutenant Blake. Is he around? I saw him arrive earlier. He's here somewhere. Thanks. God, my hands are trembling. I gotta keep my act together. At least for now. Video memo recording, Agent 47023, Nam and Jaden, Tuesday, October 4th, 2011. Time is 8.14 a.m. Unrelated to the investigation. Lieutenant Blake, I'm Agent Norman Jaden from the FBI. I went by your office this morning, they told me you'd be here. Now if you're looking for rain, dead bodies, and highways, you come to the right place. Mike, will you tell that asshole with the bulldozer to stop for five minutes? I can't hear myself think here. Right away, Lieutenant. Well, are you coming, Jaden? So, what happened? Some guy taking his dog for a piss found a body about 6 o'clock this morning. We don't know much more right now. Based on what we've seen, looks like the work of the origami killer. Has the time of death been established? Based on the rigor mortis, must be less than six hours ago. We should know more once the coroner has had a look. <laughs> Any news on the coroner? He's on his way, Lieutenant. We've been waiting for an hour, for fuck's sake. Has the body been identified? No, not yet. We should know more later today. There are a lot of people on the crime scene. Aren't you afraid your men might destroy some clues? You don't find proof sitting behind a desk. We're not in the habit of trampling things into the ground, even if we're not in the FBI. No, no, of course not. That's, that's not what I meant. Tony! I don't want to see a single shit stirring journalist within a mile of here. You got it? Yes, Lieutenant. Any witnesses? None yet. Yeah, given the neighborhood, I'd be surprised if anybody saw anything. Do you have any leads? My men are going over to scene with a fine-tooth comb. If the killer left anything behind. We'll find it. Listen, I I'm a little busy here. Why don't we discuss all this a little later, back at the office? Well, no problem. I understand. Do you mind if I have a look around? Be my guest! Hey, Jaden. Come and see me if you find anything, okay? We're on the same team now. Sample of no interest. It comes from one of the policemen present on the wasteland.
some orchid pollen. The concentration of pollen in the air is quickly decreasing because of the rain, but it gets higher in the direction of the body. Airy comment. The pollen particles disappear in the tall grass. It's probably the end of the trail. Footprints continue just after the pollen trail. There's a good chance that they're the killers. Very common. Traces of blood detected on the fence behind the railroad line. The blood report indicates an advanced and long-lasting state of exhaustion. Good chance that they're the killers. Barry Kerman. Tire tracks on the side of the boat behind the railroad line. It may be the killer's car. Why the hell is there blood here? There's a railroad track near where the body was left. Same as all the other victims. The body is still here. visible signs of violence. An orchid was placed on the victim's chest.
a small origami figure in the right hand. Fingers were probably closed after the time of death. Superficial wound on the right thigh. The blood is identical to that on the fence. His face is covered with mud, like the other victims. The victim is Jeremy Bowles, declared missing five days ago. See reference file. I think I've seen all there is to see. I'm heading back to the office. You stayed? No, I've seen enough. I'm leaving too.